Oi, boys, welcome, welcome to another video on the channel. We are back with the first ever 2022 NRL showcase. So, how we'll do with this season is we'll take a look at the uh, fixtures for the week, we'll pick out a game of the week, and we'll play as one of those teams. For today, we'll be playing as the 2022 round two Sydney Roosters. As for the overalls, the Roosters here are an 8 to 1 overall to Manly's 80. As for the settings, we'll be playing at the Sydney Cricket Ground. Legend difficulty seven minutes and we should be good to go. All right, let's run it. So both these teams coming off disappointing losses in round one. Uh, Manly, somewhat excusable playing the current champions and are notorious slow starters, but having Tommy Turbo in there for round one, a lot of a lot of uh, people expected Manly to hit the ground running. Penrith, on the other hand, had other plans. And man, they were ruthless. As for the Roosters, uh, the most disappointing performing team of the round, in my opinion. Pretty much the opposite of Manly. They usually start well. And given that they had a somewhat full strength team against an average looking Knights team on paper, that made it worse. Their forwards got smashed also. Can we just quickly talk about that Manly game and how, uh, how good Penrith looked? I know it's only round one, but they really looked like a class above the rest of the league. Their work in defense looked elite as expected, or as you'd expect from the current oh, champions. Yo. Oh, hang on a sec. A little break here from Saab. Getting run down though, Tedesco, the skipper. Would they try saving tackle? Okay, we could, uh, we could be in for a long game here. This is feeling pretty rough already as we get the knock on. But yeah, like I was saying, Penrith's work in defense was uh, suffocating. They literally drowned the Manly Ford pack with aggression, crazy line speed. I mean, they even got pinged a few times for being offside, but, but yeah, Penrith were pretty impressive without their main shot caller. You know what? 10 meters gained, we're barely, we're barely going to be able to talk about anything this game. And there you go. At least they take the two points. That was a, a terrible first set. I do feel like for the Roosters, there's a little bit of pressure on maybe the uh, the veterans in the front row for them. Uh, like Maria Hargreaves, Silsiwa Daugiaho. They do have some young guns coming through. Lindsay Collins, not a young gun, but uh, coming off a pretty long layoff as well. They just need a bit more time than usual to gel, I guess. And I actually think they'll start cooking rather sooner than later. It's just rust for the Roosters, really. As we try and get a kick away, it was actually touched. Let's go, Toops. Big Donagi. We'll try save there from Tom Trebojevic. Want to come back to the left. We tried drawing in two. That's tough to draw and pass in this game, man. As we work it out wide, we needed to pass that. Two to go. Crichton thought he'd have the speed to get around there, but we're gonna actually drop it on the toe here with Walker. A bit of cheese to start off the match. Who wants it? Dabdiaho. Classic late footwork from Siwa. Walker looking for another big man. He gets flattened. And Manly will get a shot here with three minutes to go. Nothing doing there. Oh, kill him. Quick hands, Morgan Harper. All split two defenders. So it is eight points to six heading into the break here. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and make some changes. All right, so we have three to bring on. I guess Connor Watson off for Drew Hutchison. Let's go Baker to play at lock. Just to get Radley fresh for end game and Nat Butcher for Cetili Tuponua. Close game, close game. It's a bloody sweat fest. Okay, I was thinking we could just chill and have a laid back showcase for you with the Roosters, but nope. One legend. We really got to sweat it out. We need a decent kick. Oh, why did he come back to this side? I think the kick might be good still. Now we get a terrible bounce. That should have been a good kick. Nonetheless, we wrap Turbo up just around halfway. Take him out. Threading with that sideline. How good's the ref's jerseys though? 
Shout out to Cormac. Come on, bro. We should have stepped him. I thought for sure we're about to sidestep him off uh, Tedesco there. Get in there. Great Jabojevic powers his way over. First tackle. Got a little dart with Hutchison. Wanna come? Keep playing to the left. Radley. Smith. Straight through. Bit of cheese. Not gonna lie. Bit of cheese to get away from the turbo. We might actually go all the way here. And yeah, we will. Billy Smith. Scores the second try of the match. Finally. Look, man. We'll take it. We've been struggling big time. But we finally score. This time on the short side. Little ball puts Billy Smith through. We kind of cheese our way around Tom Trebojevic, but that's for the conversion. To make it two. And that is 12 points to 14. Third tackle. Almost 10 to go. All right, Teddy, where you at, brother? I'm gonna come down this left edge. Oh, no. No, no, no. The big fella wrapped up. Alakawatu. Look at that. And we can't stop anymore. That has been a pretty tough game, man. Manly just feel OP. They feel faster, they feel more powerful. Final play of the game. Can we end it with a try? Sam Walker. Back out to Billy Smith. And that should be the game. First NRL showcase of the season. We lose with the Sydney Roosters again to Manly. Let's uh, let's wrap this thing up. All right, so Manly, too good in the end. Not how you want your first showcase to go. You know, I was thinking game of the round type beat, but if you got any suggestions on who you want to see me play as for a future showcase video, go ahead and hit me up in the comment section. Also, a poll will be going out shortly for our next NRL career mode team. We're just going to slowly ease our way into content season. You've seen a little variety here and there. I will be doing more IRL stuff revolving around the league, as well as that third career mode series coming up. So expect a poll for that. And like I said, uh, let me know suggestions on who you want me to showcase. We're going to mix it up with the way we make those or how we structure those videos too. But for now, if you enjoyed that, and would like to see more Lead Life 4 content or more content in general, be sure to run straight that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you later. <laughs>